In this video, we're going to look at how to remove a student from your Moodle course. If you go to the administration panel, you'll see an assigned roles link. And if you click on that, it'll take you to a page that has all of the roles in your course. Now, you're not going to see the administrator or maybe the course creator links. Your top one is probably going to be the teacher role. Um, but typically, you're going to be looking to remove a student. And if I click on the student role here, it's going to bring up a list of all my existing users here on the left-hand side. Now, from the assigned roles, this is the same place where we go to add people. Um, when we actually want to remove them, we go into the same panel to do that. Now, on the left-hand side here, we've got under existing users, I'm going to go looking for a user named John Logan. And you notice they're alphabetized by the last name. So I'm going to continue to scroll down here to Logan. And here we have John Logan. And all I need to do to remove that student from my course is click the Remove button. And they're going to be removed. You notice now there's 599 existing users in this course. Um, and that, that user has been moved over to the Potentials Users list. And once that's happened, that takes effect immediately. Now, one difference between Moodle and Blackboard is if you remove a student from your course, you do not lose all the grades and everything. So if you need to bring that student back in to check grades or something, if you bring the student back into the course, their participation in that course will be restored and it will be visible to you again. Uh, in Blackboard, those things are all deleted. Quizzes and different types of assignments and things are all deleted out of Blackboard when you remove somebody from the course. That is not the case in Moodle. So if you happen to need to move a student back into the course because you've accidentally removed them, um, their materials will come back in. Also, when you move, remove somebody from the course, it happens instantly. There is a button down here to assign roles in this course, but you do not need to click it for that to take um, place and have that student removed. As soon as you move them from the existing users list over to potential users, that student has been removed. The button is just placed there for people who are looking for some button to apply it. Um, it doesn't really serve much of a function beyond giving somebody the comfort of knowing that they're, they've clicked a button to enforce um, that change. It will reload the page and take you back here. So the other way you can get back is to click on uh, the breadcrumb trail to go back to your course. So I'm going to go ahead now that I'm back at the assign roles page, I'm going to go ahead and go back into my course. And that's the process for removing a student from your course. There is also a video clip available on how to enroll a student in your course. And as long as a student has a Moodle account, you can add them to your course.